Hello everyone, today I'm gonna show you how we can use custom text font in NanoCAD. So let's go to some browser and uh, here we will try to download some uh, text font called transport medium and uh, we will also try to use some local text font. In this case we will use some Hindi text font. So let's start with the transport medium. We will use any of this link. You can go to Google and you can type any custom font you need and you can download from Google here is the website so I will download it uh, it is it is uh, wise to read the instruction the the instructions uh, for using this free text font before you install on your system so I'm okay now and I will uh, I will go to the folder where I download it and uh, this is the text font in a zip format so I will unzip I will use uh, 7 zip and I will unzip to some folder this is fine I will also download the Hindi text font maybe we can uh, take this websites reference Hindi fonts and uh, I can take uh, Kruti Dev 010 regular so I can download this okay so it will be downloaded okay so we can save it to we will also unzip and uh, extract all the files to some files so now we have Kruti Dev uh, for Hindi text font and at the same time we have uh, also downloaded the transport medium text font okay so now the next uh, step will be to go to control panel on your system so in this case I will write control panel so I'll go to control panel and I will search for that font so maybe I can make it small and uh, I should have some options to add font so this is the options so now these are all the fonts uh, we are using uh, with Windows but if you need to add some uh, new fonts you can always download and you can copy and then you can paste right so on this case I'm uh, I'm going to use this uh, both of this TTF so I will copy and I will say paste so the moment I will paste it will get installed automatically on Windows right same way I will also add Kutidev for Hindi so I will add the phone to Windows and it will also get installed right so now if we can search okay so here is the font we just add it and transport medium so transport so as you can see this is the transport uh, font we just add it right so now we're okay and now we can go to NanoCAD so as you can see that NanoCAD is already open so to use those uh, added font you need to restart uh, NanoCAD once right as we were working with NanoCAD and then we added the font to Windows so you need to just close NanoCAD and and, and from now onwards you will be able to access the font within NanoCAD so I will go back to NanoCAD so I'll open NanoCAD fine so now we should go to maybe we can hover to classic view and then we can find the textile right so here is the textile so now as you can see my uh, textile name is standard I'm okay with that and the font so I should be able to find the font uh, maybe I can type you no know, 
so I should be able to find Kruti Dev. So here is the font Kruti Dev 010. So I will select and it's a regular one. So Kruti Dev regular. So I will set it current and I'm saying okay. So now if I write some text, so I'll go for text command and uh, height. I'm okay, orientations. And now I can type some text. So I'm not familiar with Hindi language, but I can type and I don't have any keyboard for Hindi, but I can always type uh, the English. And as I am using the Kruti Dev Hindi font, and as you can see, it's it's now supporting the Hindi fonts, right? If you have Hindi keyboard or you know how to write Hindi using English keyboard, so then you can write uh, Hindi. So this is uh, this is the text in NanoCat using Hindi font, right? So now the same text. Uh, if we go again to the format and uh, text style and this time I will change it to transport medium right so I'll go to transport okay so now you can see I have uh, transport and transport heavy so I'll choose transport and then I can choose medium so now I'm changing the text font so this text uh, which is now in Hindi it should change right so as you can see so this is the text uh, in uh, transport medium so this is how you can uh, write custom text using uh, Hindi or any custom font you need to use in NanoCAD and make sure when you use this kind of additional local text font you should use NanoCAD uh, e-transmit feature when uh, you will send the files to clients or someone who needs to view on their system so on that case if you send the file using e-transmit in nanocat so those fonts those additional local fonts which you will be used in the drawing will also be supplied to your client or the persons who will view the files from you how e-transmit work we have a several video on uh, wave you can find one and you can understand how e-transmit work in nanocad so it is wise to send file through e-transmit if you are using additional text font and other resources with uh, cat files that's all for today see you next time